VR is a great place to get fit and the MetaQuest platform is even better for that as it's completely wire free. So here are my top 10 fitness games I think you should try on your Quest 2, your Quest Pro, your Quest 3, whatever you've got to help you get fit and actually have some fun whilst you're doing it. I will place links to all the games in the description down below so you can go check them out for yourself. Welcome to my tech gear, let's get into it. FitXR is a full body workout that will see you punch, block, squat, stretch, and even dance your way to fitness. You can choose from five different studios, box, dance, sculpt, combat, and hit. And with hundreds of on-demand classes and seven new workouts each week to choose from, you are sure to find the right workout that will get you moving, no matter your preference or skill level. There are tutorials for each studio so you can easily learn the moves, and the graphics, while simple, are easy to follow with some great music to get you going. Now that variety comes at a cost though, as it is one of the few games out there that is subscribed based. So you have to pay either $10 per month or $84 per year to access these workouts. It does come with a 7 day free trial though so you can try before you buy if this sounds like your cup of tea. Golf Plus is the most popular and highly rated golfing game on the platform. You can practice your skills at the clubhouse, learn how to drive a little further and fine tune those putting skills before heading out onto the course. This is a great fitness game as you can play for hours without even realising it as you'll just be having so much fun. There's even weekly challenges to keep things interesting as well as four mini golf courses to play if you want to slow the pace down a little. Go out onto the green and either take the course on yourself or team up and play with friends. And after you've finished the round you can just chill out at Top Golf for a night of music and games. There's as much a social aspect to this game as there is a fitness one. Now I would recommend getting a golf grip for your controller to make this game even better. I've reviewed some before so I'll leave links to them in the description down below for you. But even without it this is a great golfing game. Whilst not a fitness game I can assure you that this game will get your heart rate pumping. Pistol Whip is an on-rail shooter where you shoot pretty much anything that moves as bad guys, cowboys and even robots come out of every nook and cranny to try and kill you. You do this whilst avoiding the bullets coming at you in Matrix style slow-mo along to the thump of some awesome soundtracks. The developers are constantly releasing new content for this and the harder levels will leave you exhausted at the end of it. It's that constant variety that keeps the game engaging and new. It's an action-packed and fast-paced game and on the harder levels your quads are are going to be killing you with the amount of ducking, diving, sidestepping and weaving you have to do to survive in this game as you avoid the bullets, walls and obstacles that lie in your way. Pistol Whip makes you feel like John Wick, I never get tired of it, it's awesome fun. O-Shake will see you using your whole body to duck, dive and weave your way around obstacles, punch walls, collect coins and strike a pose to match the hold in the myriad of walls that come straight for you. With 4 difficulty levels and 47 different songs, there's plenty of variety here, you can even create your own levels using your own songs which is awesome. With no controller buttons or sticks to worry about and the game simply being controlled by the movement of your body it's certainly an easy game to get into with the easier levels being a great introduction to the game's mechanics before moving on to something a little more difficult. So there's a level to suit pretty much everyone. Weaving around the walls, punching through them and striking a pose like Madonna is just plain fun and totally engaging. So much so that this game will keep you active for hours and without realising it you'll be working out like you've never done before. If you like to get fit whilst playing sports then it's time to go shoot some hoops in Gym Class Basketball VR. This game has no rival in this space and offers a truly unique experience that's well worth a try. The graphics are simple but well done and the mechanics of the game are easy to learn. You can play a solo session to learn the basics and practice your layups and stunt shots and then take it to the court against AI bots to test your skills. It's online though and against real people where the real fun is. Go 1v1, 2v2, even 3 v3 or play the various mini games and drills to up your game and play with others from around the world. With plenty of trash talking, it is basketball after all, and a few games under your belt you'll be having so much fun that you'll forget you're working out. And best of all, it's free. Supernatural lets you work out from stunning locations around the world all from the comfort of your own home. Not that you'll be comfortable for long though as there are over 500 workouts to choose from with new ones being added every day so there's always the perfect workout ready for you to get stuck into. And with cardio and boxing sessions as well as stretching and meditation options all on hand to choose from it really is aiming to be the fitness game for all people. And therein lies the problem because it isn't for all 
people. You can only buy this game if you live in the US or Canada due to licensing issues with the music that they use in game. So for those of you in North America, it's also another game that operates under a subscription model. So you have to pay either $19 a month or $180 a year to access the workouts. Still, it comes with a 14 day free trial. So if you live in North America, then try it out. You've got nothing to lose. Dance to the rhythm and immerse yourself in the world of audio trip. It's basically Beat Saber for clubbers as it focuses on dance moves rather than the hack and slash mentality that other rhythm games such as Beat Saber promote. You'll be catching gems, riding ribbons, smashing drums and dodging barriers as you move your body in dance like moves that is a unique feel in a genre that can often feel very repetitive. There are over 120 different levels to choose from across 30 songs and you can even upload your own songs and custom levels too. There's also a campaign mode which will allow you to unlock modifiers and change up your trips. There's some good licensed music in here from the likes of Lady Gaga and others and it's not geo-locked like Supernatural is so everyone can enjoy it no matter where you live which is a good thing. Unleash your inner dancer in this upbeat and fast fitness game. 11 Table Tennis is an oldie but a goodie. It is a super realistic VR sports sim that feels the closest you'll get to actually playing table tennis in real life without actually doing it and is a great way to get fit without actually focusing on getting fit. You can start off with the mini games to get you learning the mechanics of the game and improve your skills and then move on to the AI computer opponents. Crank that difficulty level all the way up to World Master though and you could find your game over in minutes. The game also allows you to go online and play against other real opponents around the world. There are some insanely good players out there but you can choose between either competitive or social games and the games will try to match you up with similarly skilled people. There's a great community out there with this game so it's a great way to meet up with people and just have some fun whilst getting fit. Thrill of the Fight is a true boxing simulator where you get as much out of it as you put in. The game monitors how strong your punches are and adapts to match so that no matter how strong you are you will have an equal chance of progressing and completing the game. You can practice your combos and speed work as well as train with a sparring partner in the gym before heading out into the ring to take on various opponents. This is full room scale VR. You will definitely need space for this one as you find yourself moving around the boxing ring trying to find the opening to take your opponent down. It not only exercises your arms and upper body but your core will feel it too as your body stabilizes you through full on heavy air punches. This game is a serious fitness workout if you put the effort in. The fact that it's only $9.99 is the icing on the cake here and it makes it one of the best fitness games that you can buy. Les Mills is the world's leading fitness company and they have teamed up with the development house that brought you O-Shape to bring you Les Mills Body Combat. With over 50 workouts to choose from all with varying intensities there's something for everyone here no matter your fitness level to ensure you get a full body workout. Each workout varies in intensity and duration as you punch, lunge, do smackdowns and duck and weave around walls as they come at you which is a notable nod to the developer's previous game of O-Shape. You can get fit by yourself or along with your friends and even track your progress on the leaderboard. One of the best things about this game is that it's a one-time fee. No in-app purchases, no subscription model, you get all the workouts, everything for one upfront cost. So that, combined with a variety of workouts, make this one of the best fitness games you can buy. These are some of the best VR fitness games that you can get right now for the Quest platform. I will place links to all of them in the description down below so you can go check them out for yourself. If you do try any of them, let me know what you think of it in the comments down below. And actually, if there's any game that you think that I've missed off this list that you think should have been on it, then also let me know in the comments down below as well. If you want to check out some more great games to play, then be sure to check out the link up here. Thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the next one.